I, Jacob, take you, Brianna. I, Jacob, take you, Brianna. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or worse. For better or worse. For richer or poor. For richer or poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are separated by death. Until we are separated by death. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. I give you my promise. I give you my promise. I, Bree, take you, Jacob. I, Bree, take you, Jacob. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or worse. For better or worse. For richer or poor. For richer or poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are separated by death. Until we are separated by death. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. I give you my promise. I give you my promise. the invitation of Brianna and Jacob, along with their family and loved ones in the presence of God, to witness the joining of two lives as one in marriage. It has been a true joy to walk with both of you as you have been planning for this day, and it's finally here. You have both shared with me how strong the alignment of your faith has grown, and today begins a tra trajectory of you together walking hand in hand with God guiding you. By chance, but I like to think by faith, God has been orchestrating an incredible relationship that neither of you probably realized when you became such good, good friends. Our God is a faithful God. With this ring, with this ring, I seal my promise. I seal my promise to be your faithful and loving husband. To be your faithful and loving husband. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. And Bree, will you take the ring and place it on the third finger of Jacob's left hand and repeat after me? With this ring, with this ring, I seal my promise. I seal my promise to be your faithful and loving wife. To be your faithful and loving wife. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. <laughs> Because of the love for each other and because of the vows you have taken before God and us, it is my privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. Jacob, you may now kiss your bride. For the first time, I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Jacob and Brianna Holbrook.
it's a graffiti hammock. And we're just chatting and she starts telling us like, okay, so I've got to give Jacob an answer. Like <laughs> he won. I told him like he wants, you know, he wants to go on a date. And at this point I would met Jacob a couple times and already had a good feeling about him. And I, we, Maddie and I kind of pushed her and we're like, what, like what, why not? And she couldn't really come up with a reason. <laughs> she was just like, I don't, I don't know. Like, I'm, I'm not sure. And we were like, Brianna, I'm like, he's just waited long enough. Like, give him a chance. Like, <laughs> one day, like. <laughs> we were like, at least just try. So, yeah. So I like to think, and then a few days later, I think was their first date. So I like to think whether it's true or not that I had a little bit of influence on that, <laughs> on them becoming a thing. Brianna and Jacob, I'm so happy you guys found each other. Um, so often I hear people, like myself included, talk about how you guys are cold and you guys are adorable. So um, I love you both so much. I can't wait for you guys to start your lives together. Welcome to the English, Jacob. <laughs> IU Dance Marathon has about 4,000 volunteers, plus faculty, staff, people you're, you know, in the community you're working with, the Riley people, all those things, not including that 4,000. So just imagine the bravery that it takes to go in front of all those people and say, yeah, I'm the best guy to lead this. This is, it's me. Um, and then you have to be right. You can't just then like, lie to everyone and say, yeah, this is fine. You have to then do it. Um, I would be lying at this point if I said that the thought that maybe he only did that to spend more time with Bree <laughs> hadn't crossed my mind. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, pretty sure he did. Like 50, 50, 50. <laughs> but I do think that that being where you two spent so much time together at the start, I think it does say something about you. It says something about what you value and what you care about and what you share together. Uh, I've never seen a couple so kind and so caring and so delightfully weird. Um, <laughs> and I know you guys are gonna have a great, great life together. Uh, I love you both and my glow drink is over here, but I'd like to propose a toast to the bride and groom. Whoa.